Alright, hey guys, how's it going? Barsh here, as you already know. And today, I got yet again another package. This one is not going to contain any glass. So, all of you glass lovers out there right now might get a little disappointed. But, if you're a gamer, you might get a little excited just because, uh, well, I guess I shouldn't say if you're a gamer because not all gamers are a fan of these products. But, uh, right now, like, because me personally, if you may have seen in my previous videos or if you talk to me on Tiny Chat, you probably know I'm a Razer fan. So, <clears throat> me being a Razer fan and just getting a 360, fucking, I figured I'd get their new controllers. So, okay, there's my receipt, bunch of paper. Here's one controller two controllers and then on the bottom here look at that we got a mouse pad but okay anyway so now this box out of the picture get it up here take that up back in the razor scarab it's supposed to be like a white fucking uh kind of a well, actually, it's got that color there. But okay, it, it'll be more brighter than my natural mouse pad that I have right now. So when I put my buds on it to show you guys, you'll actually be able to see something, most likely. But anyways, it, it's kind of cool. It comes in one of these cases, as you can probably tell. But uh, Razer always has fucking a lot of shit in their packaging. Like, every time. But let's pop that off. Let's just see what this looks like real quick here. And that'd be the mouse pad itself right there. But okay, so we're going to get to this in a moment. Well, I'm going to get to that in a moment, I should say. Because now this is the part everybody's waiting for. The controllers. So. Let's just get this going here. Okay, so as you guys may see, it is the Razer Onza Tournament Edition. So, it is the higher priced controller that they have. But, um, meanwhile, I don't know how the hell to open this thing. So, I'm just going to go by this sticker so far. Cut this open. I don't know why it doesn't want to cut open all the way. There we go. Okay. Fucking, they put rubber pieces on top of that. <laughs> like, they actually had a rubber piece for what you would hang it on, like, in store displays. <laughs> but it's a grommet. <laughs> in the shape of one of those. Fucking, that's funny. Oh, man. But, okay. So now, basically, though, we got the controller here. Pop it up. There we are. And then the little booklet just flew out of here. Well, might as well check out what's in the booklet. Looks to me like their certificate of authenticity. Got some stickers. And okay, so yeah, that's really all that is, the certificate of authenticity. But okay. And so, yeah. Now, I've been getting a lot of people who've been asking me even if the controllers seem good because I've been letting people know that I was getting them. But, uh... I have no clue. <laughs> Not a clue. But as of right now, it seems as if it's alright. I mean, right now I don't see a problem with it. But I just have to do that because that shit was not going to get out any other way quicker than that. 
but take this off. Okay, so this would be the controller itself. It's got some supposedly 15 feet worth of braided cable, but I don't know. The controller itself right there. It actually looks pretty cool. Pretty cool. Has a nice feel to it. Like a lot more grip it seems. And then uh, triggers go up a lot more. Makes it kind of easier to just lay your hands on the back of it. And yeah. The buttons I can already tell are going to be a little getting used to because they like they're very small sensitive and I don't know if you can hear that clicking but it's definitely a new feel in sound and then this d-pad really yeah it, it's more specific now on which arrow you push so yeah that, that, that seems like it's gonna be really nice I'm gonna have to give these a go though and then I'll have to post a week later or something on my full response. Because, I mean, so far, it seems like it's going to be pretty legit. But I don't know for sure. I still have yet to fully try it. So I'll be sure to let you guys know, though, in time, you know, I'm not going to leave you guys hanging. But so we'll set that down just for now because that's all it is is uh, another... Another tournament edition controller. So, I mean, I'm not just going to waste the time on, of unboxing two of them. Because, I mean, there's nothing special on seeing me unbox the same thing twice. At least, I don't know. If it's glass, maybe it's a different story. Because at least it looks new every time. Meanwhile, when it's a controller, I mean, it's a fucking controller. So, <laughs> not going to stay too much on that. But close up my blade here and then I'm gonna fucking take this rip here cuz I packed up a bowl in the queen bee threw on the inline onto the beaker I still have yet to fully give this a go so therefore the rip will be on YouTube and on top of that I got my bee lasso ready I'm actually set this video okay so um yeah what else was I missing here? The other thing I'm missing is I'm planning on hosting a contest. What contest? I don't know. When? Hopefully soon. Because, I mean, I'm, I'm just waiting for an idea on what I should do for a contest. But, I mean, I want to make it simple. I want to make it so people don't have to do like anything too serious or too hard to enter. But I need ideas. You guys post comment ideas down below as for what this contest should be. Don't make it something too hard. And, it, like, um, I've already had a couple of my buddies and shit just recommend, like, make a biggest bong hit video or some shit like that for the contest. I do not want any of that because of that simple fact. Like, the hardcore smokers, what if they're down to a low bit of weed that day and they can't take as big of a rip as they would like to? Or what if the people are big tokers and they're just new and they haven't had enough weed to even buy a big amount? Like, I mean, just in general, I'm not trying to make people spend money or anything in this process. I just want it to be a easy contest, if you guys get my drift. And, um... I just don't know what to do. So, I mean, if you guys <laughs> come up with some ideas, because, I mean, liking, favoriting, and uh, subbing will be a basic thingamajig for the contest. But I just want one other thing in there. And I, I don't know. I, I don't know what it should be. But on that note, guys, because I need something to help me think before I get on out of here. Cheers. Bam, that works good. Oh, yeah. 
I gotta love that OG. I gotta love it. Whew. But alright, guys. Till next time. I'm out. Not out. But I'm out.